Riders, how you doing? It's Paul with the Ride Home Review. Uh, this, this week I um, saw Black Klansman, which stars uh, John David Washington, Adam Driver, Topher Grace, and uh, it's directed by Spike Lee. Uh, don't forget that you can catch all of these reviews on YouTube. Uh, go to Ride Home Reviews on YouTube and check out all the reviews that I've done thus far. Also, follow us on Instagram. Um, uh, the synopsis is pretty pretty simple. Um, uh, John David Washington plays Ron Stallworth, uh, the first the, the first uh, black police officer in Colorado Springs, and he goes undercover and then chooses to infiltrate the Ku Klux Klan. Um, and it starts with a phone call and escalates from there. Um, but of course you're probably thinking, um, how can he meet anybody of the clan when he's black? Well, uh, that's, uh, where he tag teams with Adam Driver, uh, and Adam Driver's character, uh, Flip. Um, this was a Spike Lee joint. Um, so therefore, um, the technical aspects are always going to be great. The editing is absolutely marvelous. Um, the story was really good. Um, it flowed really well for the most part. Um, I really enjoyed, um, the juxtaposition, uh, that they, of, of imagery that they showed, um, and some of the ironies and, um, uh, so therefore, um, it, yeah, it was, it was just really well done. I mean, and, uh, it was cast well as, uh, the, the characters were just great. Um, and so it just, there's a lot of tension in various scenes and I thought that was played up very well. Um, uh, now, uh, you know, there's also the flip side when it comes to the Spike Lee films and, you know, there's sometimes a uh, political side to it and if you're yeah. and so it gets really there there's there's political aspects to it and so however um i don't think that they're out of place um in this in this situation and it's kind of a unique story is based on a true story and um i just thought it was executed well uh but it was uh, there were there were some times where it felt a little long, um, and there was some uh, pieces of the story plot that just didn't resolve itself, um, and uh, and the ending went a little long. So, but all in all, it was a pretty decent movie, and I really enjoyed it. Uh, something to watch for. Um, some hints. I like how there are some hints that allude to. Because this takes place uh, in the 70s, how it alludes to uh, somewhat of the climate of today. Um, I thought that was pretty interesting, and yeah, all in all, it was uh, it was a really really good film. Um, I mean, I know that Spike Lee isn't everybody's cup of tea, but there are some really funny parts to it, as well as some really powerful parts to it. So this is a this is a uh, this is a, a film that everybody can can really uh, relate to, especially um, with the the situations they bring in and what and and uh, what's going on today. So, uh, Black Klansman is a really good film. I recommend it. Don't necessarily need to go to the theater to see it, uh, but yeah, you should check it out. Um, just well executed. Like I said, it is a little long. It feels a little long in some parts, and um, it drags a little bit here and there. But all in all, uh, pretty damn, pretty darn good. So uh, there you have it. That's the movie this week, Black Klansman, directed by Spike Lee. So until next week, watch something cool. All right, see you next week.